here we have the Mercedes C220 doing best to point out any marks and any imperfections and things like that so we'll start the front right alloy and tyre here and overall that alloy is in good shape overall can't see anything wrong with it and on the front right tyre we've got just over five and a half mil of tread so plenty on there I've had a good look around and I can't really see too much to point out at all on this one so it's a really really tidy car overall and on the back right alloy that's really tidy again as well I can't see any curbing or anything like that and on this back right tyre so you've got an Avon that's nearly a new tyre well basically a new tyre on the back there nearly 8mm of tread so absolutely loads on there of course you've got the rear parking sensors as well even on the back I can't see it there's a little bit of wear uh, just on the plastic there but um, I can't see any bumps or anything like that on it plenty of room in the boot there and now coming round the back left hand side of the C-Class here and you've got the back left alloy and tyre as well and overall this alloy is really good as well can't see any scuffs nothing like that another Avon tyre and just over 7mm of tread so absolutely plenty of tread on those back tyres come around the left hand side here as well and the front left alloy and tyre and it's usually if any it's usually this alloy that gets hit the most but I can't see again um, I can't see any scuffs or anything like that and on the front left tyre we've got just over 5 mil of tread or nearly 5 mil of tread so plenty on there still as well but if I just show you up alongside the car you can see those water droplets but I can't see any any bumps or anything coming around the front bumper now and one of the only things I've managed to notice which is probably the worst bit in my opinion but even then not that bad uh, it's a few inches long and um, almost like a scuff that's been touched in I'll try and sort of get a bit closer so you can see and if I stand about a meter away I mean you can only really see when you're about this level with it as well um, from sort of up here it's really difficult to see that's just worth pointing out obviously it's something you will get on a five-year-old car a few little marks but I'd say generally it's really really tidy little chip there a few more little stone chips but they are really really tiny and overall that's in very very clean condition uh, the windscreen free from any chips or cracks or anything like that and you have got the two keys with this one as well and so we've got the driver's door here of course you've got the heated seats as well well, that's just a bit of a mud mark that'll come off driver's leather seat all in really good condition and if I show you inside now as well so you've got just over 31,000 miles on this one and if I just start it up as well and there we go as you can see it's all running exactly as it should be no warning lights on the dash or anything like that uh, steering wheel that's all in good condition you've got your automatic lights just down there I'll just turn that on as well I'll just show you the rest of it whilst it's loading you've got a few very light little scratches on here uh, but again that's being ultra fussy Overall, it's a very, very clean example. You've got the front left seat here. Again, very well looked after. The front left door. Can't see anything worth pointing out there. And if I just try and show you the... Um sat nav here working as well and as you can see that's all working fine obviously when I put it into reverse as well you've got the rear view camera and 
nice feature. And I'll just show you into the back of the car now as well. So you've got the back of the driver's door there. Back of the driver's seat. Back of the front passenger seat there. Back left door. And the rear seats. Again, I can't see any rips. You've got a few light little scratches on there, but again, nothing major. And you've got the Isofix just in the bottom of those there. There we go, that's the Mercedes C220. Overall, very nice example for a car that's five years old. Thanks for watching.